One of the teams that's been kind of flying under the radar this year has been Ed White. White came into tonight undefeated, 3-0, and they found their way up to number 7 in our News 4 Jacks Super 10 look. Listen, this at 3-0 is not a full record. They've had a couple of games that haven't happened for one reason or another, but 3-0 and and on the rise as they headed to Paxson tonight. And looking to make it 4-0, and there are the Golden Eagles from Paxson. On the attack, Colin Bell passed to Kenyon Gardner. Hit hard by Devon Patterson. Helmet goes rolling. Commanders now on offense. Christian Ellis takes the handoff. Bounces it out wide to the left. And rumbles for a nice gain. For he is finally taken down. Commanders able to walk it downfield. Then Ellis finishes off the drive with a short run into the end zone for the touchdown. It's a 6-0 Ed White lead. White back on offense. They go right back to Ellis. He turns on the speed. Another long run. Look at the long strides there. As the quarter starts to wind down, Commanders cap off the drive with another short run by Ellis into the end zone for the touchdown. White goes on to the easy win tonight. They stay undefeated. Now 4-0 with a 44-0 victory. Episcopal back home hosting Baldwin, trying to win back-to-back -back games. First drive, the Eagles march downfield. River Penland out of the pocket here and finds some action on the sideline. And the Eagles are up. Uh, to set up Urshad J.C. to make the Eagles up 7-0 after a two-yard run. Ensuing kickoff, and Episcopal learns the hard way, Baldwin has very good special teams. Armand DuBose fields this one his own four and follows his blocks, and there he goes. 96 yards for the touchdown. We are tied at seven. I mentioned special teams. Episcopal punts it away, and this time it's Cortez Martinez. Takes it at the 50. One move there. Gets to the outside. Gets the edge. Looking for a block. Gets one. And there he goes. Touchdown. Touchdown's off. Kick returns as the Indians to lead a 14-7 at halftime.